The ideas meeting here at Circe comes at a very exciting time and recognize the increasing importance of IR in terms of aortic procedures. It's almost as if there's been sort of a renaissance for IR and aortic. We started this out and then a number of practices and other disciplines actually turned out to sort of take the ball and became an increasingly part of their practice and less of ours. But now as the procedures are becoming more complicated, aortic dissection, chronic dissection, thoracoabdominal aneurysms, the catheter skills of an IR really come into play in terms of really adding and contributing to a total team effort. This multidisciplinary approach of IR with other specialties as vascular surgery, cardiology, cardiothoracic surgery, I think offer the best of all worlds where they bring the expertise, in particular catheter skills, imaging expertise, to provide the biggest benefit for patients. I think the ideas meeting here really stresses involvement, that we really need to get back in as IRs into the mix of delivering care for patients with aortic diseases. Well, I think we've come to the point where everybody agrees that endovascular plays an important role in the treatment of our patients and in many, many different pathologies, not only abdominal aortic aneurysms, also more complex abdominal aortic aneurysms and abdominal aneurysms and even also dissections. I think IDEAS is now doing fine because it offers a multidisciplinary platform to all the involved specialists. If we see at the first session it was completely packed and it was full of radiologists but also vascular surgeons. I think it's the right time because if you want to move EVAR further ahead, you really have to combine imaging and technology now together with clinical experience. If you don't do that, it won't go any further. Uh, you see now in the hybrid rooms, uh, overlay, fusion of imaging, so the technology, the imaging technology is moving on and I think interventional radiologists are the, the right people to be involved. So this is the right time to combine IR with vascular surgery uh, in the field of, uh, of EVAR. As far as uh, the value of a multidisciplinary approach, uh, the treatment of ruptured triple A's either by EVAR or open repair is not simple. It's usually difficult and done in trying circumstances and having the skills of uh, both surgeons and interventionalists available to a team will make for the best results and indeed many of the best results have been achieved by teams comprised of both surgeons and interventional specialists, particularly interventional radiologists. I'm very pleased with the turnout. It's, it's very high, much higher than expected. Every time you go into the room, you can't find a seat. It's overbooked, so for next year, we certainly have to have bigger rooms. I've always been a proponent of the multidisciplinary approach of our aneurysm patients because I think every specialty has a lot to offer. I also like to discuss these patients in full partnership rather than have one specialty taking the lead. So I think if I would give my take home point, if you will, to IRs, get involved, be involved right at the ground zero in terms of dissection and really contribute to an overall team approach to management of these patients.